Well, you've probably seen many signs like these outside of businesses all around the city. Business owners say they're having a problem trying to hire people to fill those positions. Garcia's Kitchen has eight locations and departments around the Albuquerque Metro. And we're, we're trying to make all the stores consistent with the hours that were open and closed. And at each location, you can find signs like this. But right now we're trying to hire from the stores. The owner, Dan Garcia, says right now finding employees is like finding a needle in a haystack. We've probably gone through uh, in the last year and a half at least 100 employees. And he's not the only one. Flying Star, Il Vicino, Pokey Pokey, the list goes on. Some places are even having to shorten operation hours and even close because of the lack of staff. You know, it, it's made it to where um, sometimes I'm here at the Coors location or at the other locations and people are driving up and wanting to eat and we're closed. Right now, there are nearly 92,000 New Mexicans receiving unemployment benefits and even more nationwide. But I think that sometimes people can get paid the same whether they stay home or go to work. Garcia says with a diverse range of positions and increased wages, he hopes to attract more potential employees to help keep his doors open without restrictions. If they come in one day, we, we hope to have them working the next day. Garcia also says he does about 25 interviews every week, but this week he was only able to hire two people. He says they still have 45 positions to fill. Live in Albuquerque, Shelley Leggett, KOAT Action 7 News.